It's being called a triple demic. A harsh start to flu season, along with COVID and now RSV infections, is now beginning to strain pediatric hospitals in several states. Jeff Paul has the details. Respiratory illnesses combined with new COVID strains and the onset of cold and flu season have health officials worried that hospitals could be put under a stress test this winter. We are seeing an already busy hospitals um, even busier. So definitely um, we're, we're seeing it and feeling it. The latest concern is RSV, a respiratory virus with cold-like symptoms. Anyone can get it, but it poses the biggest threat to babies and toddlers. It makes breathing difficult, which in turn makes it hard for them to eat. The virus is spreading at its fastest rate in 25 years, with almost three quarters of pediatric hospital beds now occupied. What worries me is if we then add influenza and COVID on top of that, that's where I think we can start getting into trouble. There's no specific treatment for RSV. Most cases are a matter of managing symptoms and letting the virus run its course. Severe cases may require patients to be put on a breathing tube or ventilator. There's also no vaccine for it, though several candidates are in the testing phase. Doctors say you can do your part by getting your flu and COVID shots to keep yourself out of the hospital. Are we worried about what this winter is going to look like? Sure. And so that's why we're encouraging so many people to please get that flu vaccine, get that COVID-19 bivalent vaccine, and stay home if you're sick. We have to make sure those beds are open for those kids. Doctors say an RSV vaccine could be approved by next fall. In Los Angeles, Jeff Paul, Fox News.